Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. Today in this session, I am going to explain how to uh, do the asset acquisition through PO process. I mean to say purchase order process. So in my earlier videos, I have done asset acquisition without PO. Now in this video, I am covering uh, asset acquisition with PO process. So let's get started. So first of all here we need to perform three steps uh, one is we have to create the pivo uh, with the account assignment uh, uh, with the account assignment asset as asset and then we have to do the perform uh, mygo and then myro then we will see the accounting entries so i'm starting with the creation of pivo so for the creation of for to create the pivo we need to access the transaction code me21n so here i'm entering the me21n transaction code okay now this is standard PO only now I'm selecting my vendor and then I'm giving the purchase organi organization details purchase group and company code and then here my item number is 10 and this is the account assignment so here we need to select category account assignment category uh, A as A initially we will create a uh, if non PO process is normal, normal PO if we will create uh, like uh, with the K cost center. So, for asset equation through PO purpose, we have to select the account assignment category as A and give the material. So, this is my material, and the quantity is 10 and each here and delivery date as uh, 30 11 2023, and the net price would be 1000. I'm giving and then my plan just enter and then here we need to select the asset so just a four here i'm randomly selecting one asset and then just hit enter again okay yeah now click on save and then again click on save so here we have created the PO with the 45 5 times 0 144 now the second step would be MICO let's now here I'm entering the transaction code MICO here and then here we need to select the ghost receipt and then system will automatically select the purchase order here then here we have to give the purchase order number my purchase order is 45510144 and then hit enter okay then uh if you want to do the uh, gr for only five uh, items you can select a five gear in my case i'm going for the full item full quantity and then here we can see the my account assignment here okay then here we need to select the item okay and then click on post yeah so material document ending with 182 has been posted in the system now the start third step would be myro then slash n miro Okay, here just enter the company code and hit enter and here enter the purchase order and just enter some reference here and the amount Okay, then uh, then click on simulate here so here we can see the accounting entry as a, a vendor account ready and the technical clearing account is debited so it means uh, this is a final uh, this is a accounting document entry so in the accounting uh, accounting document the entry would be vendor will be created and the asset will be debited so here I'm going one step back here 
and simulate document okay so here we don't have an option to simulate in a general ledger level so i'm going back and uh, posting it directly now let's click on post then we'll see the documents and the accounting entries so here we can see document number six zero 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 and one three has been created okay and it's uh, saying that the block for payment uh, so we can manually remove the block for the payment and we can make the payment that part i will cover later now i will show you the entries so i selected the display document and then click on the follow on documents here so here we can see the documents so this is my main document accounting document just double click here so here you will see the accounting document entry uh, which is a uh, vendor credit and uh, asset debit asset debit and go one step back and then click on uh, asset transaction this is asset accounting posting accounting document so here we can see the asset is uh, the asset gel is debited and the technical clearing account is created i don't want this one okay yeah this is the original entry in the asset accounting asset accounting side so here we can see the asset is debited and the technical clearing account is created and then uh, vendor account is credited and the technical clearing account again it's uh, debited so this this technical clearing account credit and debit will be nullified and the final accounting entry would be uh, asset uh, vendor account credit and the asset account will be debit okay now go back and click on general ledger view again showing the same entry and go one step back so i will see this document okay so this is the uh, accounting entries from the accounting side uh, accounting side and asset accounting and normal general ledger accounting so and this is the process to create create uh, sorry post the asset acquisition transaction with the pivo so that's all in this section thank you so much